Afternoon guys. Welcome to Wednesday 23rd of October. We're now in when well basically winter mode. So we have the first of the horses out. So we're in the hill field in the boys' winter grazing now. You can see it's not looking too bad now. There's a fair bit of grass on it. There's actually probably too much for horses in there. But the owners can sort all that out. They can pull them in, take them out, do whatever they like now. So I'm just in at the moment, just doing a bit of boundary work, doing all these fences. Um, you can see the tra tracks already. We've just been putting a lot of posts in, um, doubling them up, trebling them up. Um, I do do this every year, put a few more posts in, but the last batch seems to have been absolute rubbish. They were in for three or four years for that, and they snapped already. So, just been in with tractor. It's the first time I've been onto the field since all the flooding. Um, flood water was probably the height of those posts. Uh, it's actually hard enough now to bring tractor in, but funnily enough, it's so hard that I can't actually get the posts in far enough. Um, they are six foot posts, so uh, they're good for well, it's four foot out of the ground type thing. Um, but they're fine, they've got the hedge behind anyway. Um, I did manage to cut this hedge naughtily at the back end of summer uh, after the hay crop. I'm just taking it in, I don't know how well you can see it on there. But from about that height there down, I've just managed to side it all up because our hedge cutting lad won't be here. Well, I can guarantee it won't be here until spring now. So I just managed to get the flail up. I didn't video it because it's horrendous trying to do it. <laughs> trying to film it with it all crashing and banging round. And in between time you're trying to work with a hedge cutter that doesn't really want to be a hedge cutter. It's built for grass mainly. So that's it really. We've done down this side I'm just behind, well I'm behind me. Done all down here. We need to go down that side which is post and rail and then it kinks back in and then it's Y and post all the way down this side. So they're all set in, all I'm doing now is putting some staples in. Um, I say they're like a donkey's iron leg most of these posts but I don't think the horses care. <laughs> I don't particularly care, they're all in the hedge back anyway. And I say there's, there's a hedge there anyway to back us up. So that's about it really, another day, another little job done, and it's really pleasant today actually, fairly breezy, but it's uh, it's pleasantly warm. We asked forecast for a bit of rain tomorrow and then, well the heavens are going to open apparently on Friday, they're talking about 100 mil of rain in certain parts, but I don't know where. <laughs> so, We'll take what comes. So enjoy this view at the field because it might be back underwater again at this rate. Um, saying that, the ditch has dried up down here. Don't know if I can find a bit. If you can see into it, but there's, it has dried up quite a bit actually. A yeah, mucky bit of ditch down here, but. there but it's not too bad. Anyway I'm gonna leave it there and I'll catch you later. Cheers! Bye!